Now let's talk about scaling a texture. There are three ways you can scale your texture and I'm going to show you the three of them right now. For this exercise we're going to apply here tiles and we're gonna adjust their scale. So we're gonna import here some tiles. Okay, and I'm just going to put them right there. All right. Now, if I take my line tool, my drawing line tool, and I uh, measure this, it's 37 centimeters. And imagine you want this to be 60 centimeters. So the first method is basically changing the scale by eye. So if I make sure uh, this is not the right texture, if I pick the right texture here, if I change this value, it's going to change my texture. So to change this, this is 45 centimeters. So maybe it's around six here to get the right yeah, it's a bit too much, so maybe 5.5 and you just adjust it by I, it's almost 60. Okay, so maybe it's not that important to you, but you just have to get an approximate uh, scaling that that's okay. The second method is the mathematical method. So if I go back and I have this random number here, okay which we said 37, then you can go to your calculator and type in first the, the dimension you want, which is here 60, I want it to be 60 centimeters, and divide it by the number that is shown inside of SketchUp. Now I have to multiply this by this value here, and then I know which value I'm going to put right there. So this value multiplied by 3.34, 5.4, 5.4. And now if I measure, I have my 60 centimeters exactly. So that's the mathematical way. Now, if you're not into calculations, there's still a third way to do it which is a visual way. So I'm getting back here to my 37, right? Basically, you just draw wherever on your surface a square or a rectangle or whatever dimensions you're looking for. So I type in 60 by 60 here, okay? And now I get inside of my square and select the texture. Right click texture and position. So now we are inside of the textures position and we can move it all uh, around and we can adjust the scale as I said before. So that's why it's going to be useful to do it here. To be able to do that what I suggest is go take the red pin so it's not drag and drop you just click on it once you put it on the corner of your tile, pick the green pin, put it on another corner of your tile. Now you drag and drop it here and you drag and drop here. Right click, done. Okay, so now this is one tile. And this is a tricky part because if you pick the sample tool and sample this texture and sample this one for SketchUp here for the materials it's exactly the same one it's not a new one it didn't create a copy however it does make a difference if you pick this one and apply it here so now we can just delete our lines here and we have our 60 centimeters tiles all over. There you go, you have three methods to scale your textures. 
use whatever is more comfortable to you and you can really get a very accurate positioning and results in your model.